hello friends uh, since uh, last few weeks we have got some requ request requ regarding the subject of fluid mechanics so here is the quick review of our, regarding the fluid mechanics subject and sorry for the instability of the video uh, first of all there is a first chapter introduction to fluid so for the introduction to fluids there are th few definitions like uh, capillary rise and fall uh, bubble internal pressure tension and tension uh, fluid types and fluids and regarding fluids all the details corrosion and adhesions viscosity and types of viscosity and continuum so in this chapter you have to uh, uh, keep in mind that uh, be clear with the concept of fluid and uh, what are the definitions in the textbook you have to write the same definitions because whatever in your mind will not give you the full marks in this chapter so uh, there is only things about the uh, first chapter and there is a second chapter pressure and head in this chapter you have, uh, this is the most used uh, appli applicable chapter in the mechanical engineering that you will find so many applications in the real life and um, in this chapter be clear with the pressure temp uh, types of pressure uh, how the pressure difference works pressure gauge and effect of pressure variations in this chapter there are most important two questions pascal's law and hydrostatic law there is a manometer youtube manometer vertical manometer inclined column manometer and types of pressure with the uh, uh, graphical representation like atmospheric pressure gauge pressure vacuum pressure uh, borden tube gauge that used in uh, petrol pumps you know uh, be clear with the manometers and laws clean graphs and diagrams will provide you the full marks in this chapter and don't forget pascal's law and hydrostatic law at any cost there is a third chapter uh, static force and buoyancy in this chapter there is a one fixed sum they will ask to, uh, a sum from this chapter uh, there are theories like vertical immersed plate inclined immersed plate and curved surfaces what is buoyancy meta center meta centric height total pressure center of pressure effect of total pressure and center of pressure meta center and various effects equilibrium of floating body so these are the uh, yeah, these are some theories and uh, for the vertical and Im vertical immersed plate inclined immersed plate uh, inclined plate cow surfaces there are other shapes like uh, square triangle and other shapes they can ask uh, sums from these types and in this chapter be clear with the center of gravity and moment of inertia formulas uh, be clear with the figures and uh, don't forget meta center met, uh, manometers meta center meta centric height anything this is the fourth chapter motion of fluids and particles and streams so these are the theories and uh, uh, there is one theory continuity equation derivation of two dimensional and three dimensional flow uh, so just look at this uh, these are the theories and you cannot forget uh, that continuity equations derivation uh, there is a fifth chapter energy equation and its applications if you understand the uh, engineering thermodynamics there was a chapter of energy equations and application uh, so if you know that chapter you can easily understand this uh, kind of chapters uh, so in this the uh, there is a peter tube venturi meter and rotameter uh, these are three theories uh, i guess there will be one theory from this and there is a sum from peter tube and venturi meter that can be asked from this chapter uh, you can expect um, when a contractor triangular notch and rectangular notch there is a sum that can be asked from rectangular notch and triangular notch uh, there is a Bernoulli's theorem the sum and derivation expected from Bernoulli's theorem as always uh, impulse momentum principle Euler's equation discharge through orifice uh, there might be a derivation from discharge through orifice and there might be a uh, small kind of sum like the sum of uh, from two or three marks that can be asked uh, so uh, any topic can be asked from this chapter so you cannot uh, uh, skip this chapter at any cost there is a sixth chapter two dimensional ideal fluid flow uh, these are the few theories and uh, you can do this only there is no much weightage from this sum uh, there is a chances of sum from this uh, chapter you can uh, see that sums from the last uh, year's youtube papers but uh, i think uh, these theories are enough for, for this chapter Seventh chapter is dimensional analysis and, simi uh, and uh, similarities. Uh, so Buckingham's Pi theorem and Rayleigh's method. Very important. Uh, uh, anyone will be asked definitely. Either derivation, either proof, either sum, anything can be asked. So you cannot miss this. Reynolds number, Mac number, Euler's number, Ford numbers. Uh, so that can be asked uh, in uh, four marks or they can ask uh, seven marks for definitions. 
जियोमेट्रिक सिमिलरिटी डायनामिक सिमिलरिटी यू कैन डू दिस बट दिस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट एट्थ नाइन्थ एंड इलेवेंथ आई स्किप टेंथ फॉर द नेक्स्ट बट विस्कोस फ्लो टर्ब्यूलेंट फ्लो एंड कंप्रेसिबल फ्लो सो दीज आर द क्वेश्चन फॉर द विस्कोस विस्कस फ्लो दैट वॉट इज विस्कस फ्लो रेनोल्स एक्सपेरिमेंट वेलोसिटी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन सर्कुलर स्ट्रेस डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन वॉट इज टर्ब्यूलेंट फ्लो डार्सिस वे बेस्ट इक्वेशन मूडिस डायग्राम and for the comp compressible flow these are particular uh, particular definitions that you can do 10th chapter is important so i have put it aside and uh, for the 10th chapter flow through pipes you can't miss any of the theory from this chapter uh, there are three four chapters that you have to do uh, at any cost and in this chapter major and minor losses uh, siphon simple theory sum and theory for the pipe of series and parallel power transmission equations hydraulic grid grid lines and total energy lines uh, you have to do all the topics from this chapter but these topics are important that can be asked so how to plan that uh, i have scheduled that uh, there are 19th 20 and 21 there are almost 3 days for the fluid mechanics so if we consider from the 19th noon there are first second that you can do that modules in the noon 10th module in the evening in the 20th morning you can do 7th chapter it can, it will take around 3 to 4 hours minimum uh, in the noon you can do 5th one in the evening you can do 3rd one in the 9 uh, night time i have provided 8th 9th and 11th chapter and in, on the 21st morning i have provided provided 4th and 6th so you can interchange that uh, 20th night with uh, 21st morning that that can be interchanged and in the noon evening and night time there is only revision of fluid mechanics you can refer five years jt papers or questions from this video uh, i guess this is enough and if you have any query and uh, there will be a uh, there will be our email id and our numbers in the description you can contact us mm -hmm. sure like share and subscribe thank you